Hello everyone, so this is gonna be a quick episode. So here all I want to do is fixing some replication issues that we have with the armor. So if I play as the client in a new editor window, here, you see, both are actually clients. Uh, and if I collect, you can see it has two armors here and from the other's perspective we can only see one armor and also it's not attached correctly so this is what we are going to work on today okay first thing is this armor is collected using the armor GA collect test armor this ability and this is a child of GA collect sword and here I have made a mistake this should be server only okay so when I do that uh, let me now switch back to play number of players one and play as client and play in the viewport now here we can get rid of the appearing two armors so it's not activated twice but still uh, the armor is not attached properly if i play as player server i think this should get attached correctly see okay so now the reason is here if I go to the character here we have and collect items under this we have this init lead post this is the function which attach the armor mesh now let me show you here you can see this is what it does set lead post component for the SK armor, this armor mesh, skeleton mesh. So this set leader post component function is responsible for synchronizing animations with the character's body and the armor mesh. So when this is simply replicated, this chest armor is simply replicated, this is only called in the server. So we can solve it, either I may have to make it a uh, uh, RPC remote procedure call or I don't need this anymore or if I make this instead of replicated let's make it rep notified now you can see two dots and here if I double click we get a function so whenever this web uh, this variable is replicated this function is called that's the significance of rep notify and here I'll call this same function on the chest armor so this would make sure that the set lead post part is called in both clients and servers now uh, this should already work because this is server yeah and if I play as client let me make a couple more editor viewports uh, yeah. yeah let's play here this is also a client you can see now it works properly and you can see from this guy's perspective the armors are attached also correctly now let's get an armor for this guy so he also got it and it is visible from other side and if I go to inventory armor you can see two armors let me change this and it is applied here for this character and also the which change is visible from others perspective as well okay so our armor is properly replicated now 
and yeah thanks for watching that's all i want to cover here that is something i had missed in earlier episodes so updated project files will be available for download in the veteran page i'll leave the link in description and see you in the next episode goodbye